Hello everyone, uh, my name is Johar Ham. Many of you have been curious and concerned about the um, rapid spread of the coronavirus in China. Um, since the growing number of um, coronavirus cases um, continues to increase, many countries have evacuated their citizens from China um, in order to prevent um, from, uh, their citizens from being infected. So far, there has um, there has been over thirty four thousand um, people who have been infected and over seven hundred twenty deaths. And unfortunately, according to uh, to the reports, there have been confirmed cases of um, uh, coronavirus from twenty seven countries outside of China. Um, these numbers tell us um, just how highly contagious the coronavirus can be. You may already be aware of all those information I just mentioned, but what you may not know is um, before that before the transportation uh, system uh, was shut down by the government in Wuhan and the city of Wuhan, uh, where the virus or was originated, there has been over thirteen thousand uh, people who traveled to Urumqi uh, within three weeks. Uh, Urumqi, which is the capital city of the Uyghur region. And after flying to Urumqi, um, there have been people have been traveled um, further to other cities in Uyghur region. Um, and after um, and on January twenty third, um, all flights were canceled uh, from Wuhan to other cities in China uh, in very early in the morning. But except to Urumqi and to Hong Kong, which the flights were canceled in the very last minute. Because of these, many people were able to fly to Urumqi, and which has resulted in more than 39 uh, confirmed cases of coronavirus. It takes uh, 14 days uh, of, uh, for, for symptoms to show if someone um, is infected by coronavirus. So it is very likely that um, there may be um, way more cases uh, in the near future. Because of the spread of coronavirus in the Uyghur region, it could um, hit the concentration camps, which could be disastrous and lead to thousands and even millions of deaths. Um, it's very concerning for the coronavirus to spread to the concentration camp because of their uh, overcrowded and um, unsanitary, uh, with the cramped um, conditions, poor hygiene and um, poor medical support and bad immune systems, um, the spread of the coronavirus in the camps can potentially escalate um, the suffering of the Uyghurs, um, thousands or millions of Uyghurs, as I mentioned. Um, and I'm sure after hearing all this, you're very concerned now and you're wondering what you can do to help. Um, you can reach out to WHO by signing the petition. Um, um, or you can call or email whichever is uh, convenient for you. You can also call your local government officials to send delegations uh, and uh, medical teams and medical equipments uh, to Urumqi and other cities in Uyghur region um, to um, evaluate, examine, and treat um, the patients of a coronavirus from inside and outside of the camps. And most importantly, let them shut down the camps and let the Uyghur people who are um, uh, who are in camps to go back home. Also, if you have an Instagram, uh, Twitter, or Facebook account, uh, please um, post a, a photo of yourself holding a hashtag um, close the camp and um, WHO to Urumqi. Your help will be greatly appreciated by the entire Uyghur community inside and outside of China. Thank you very much.